Okay, my name is Roberto Patoșcoviu, I'm the CEO of Habitat for Humanity in Romania and I'm one of the panelists at the MINA Housing Forum. Uh, it's, it's very interesting that even though we are kind of worlds apart, Romania from Middle East and North Africa, we have similar problems with displaced populations and with refugees and we are trying now to bring our experience in supporting uh, hundreds of thousands of Ukrainian refugees in the country with housing and how this can translate here as a best practice or as challenges that we face or, or some lessons learned that we, we learn throughout the process and we can share with the, with the others. I think there are many similarities in, in addressing these very vulnerable people that have left home to find peace and shelter. We're having this Ukraine refugee response is a big, big program that we have because the problem obviously is not going away. So we're continuing to support the Ukrainian refugees with the medium-term shelter and long-term shelter solutions. That means over a year. Uh, so that they integrate better in the Romanian society and at the same time we continue with the domestic program which is supporting Romanians to get a decent and affordable home. Uh, in Romania we had to date uh, more than 1.3 million refugees, not all of them stayed in the country so many of them just transited the country. At the top of your mind when you think about refugees you think about camps you know, putting people in tents and developing camps. And I think there is a great opportunity here to move a little away from, from this perspective. For instance, what we've done in Habitat for Humanity Romania was basically an inventory of what empty buildings exist already and to refurbish those empty buildings into collective shelters. So instead of having camps, having some very proper uh, buildings that have been, have been refurbished and now they are superb uh, collective shelters. Another thing that we can look at is the social rental model, for instance, uh, looking at what's available on the rental market, putting the right subsidies, convincing the landlords to create a social rental program, and we've done that in Romania, not only in Romania, in other countries in Eastern Europe, and uh, through rental support refugees to, to get a home, not only bricks and mortar, like to build new things, but also uh, taking advantage of whatever exists in the market and using the potential of the market. They do depend on, uh, on a stock that would be available and unused. Otherwise, it's, the, the answer is very simple. You have to provide housing stock, you have to build. I mean, this is, this is the starting point.